Big H Trucking coming to you from the outside smoking area at the Cafeteria Millennium Building in Springfield. I was going to say Massachusetts, but Springfield, Missouri. Anyway, uh, update is got my truck back. Got a call um, about three o'clock this afternoon saying, ask me a couple of questions. One of the questions was, did I notice anything when I was pulling the load that there was any kind of spattering, sputting, anything along with a faulty injector? And I said, absolutely not. It ran like a top. Amber with a single burger. It ran like a top. And uh, he goes, well, we did the same thing. We took an 80,000 pound trailer out. We took it for about a 20 mile test ride. And there was nothing that I could say that there's an injector that's faulty. He goes, however, your fuel filter sitting on the rail is really trying to suck hard because it's black and the fins on it are bent, which is an indication that they're clogged. They're basically 95% clogged. So um, I said, let's do it. I said, I got the filters inside the bunk. Let's go fucking change them. Excuse my language. So we changed them out and uh, cleared the code. And we took, he took it for another ride with the trailer, came back, check engine light was off. Still off right now. Uh, so I'm thrilled to have my truck back. Thank you, Peter Bilt of Springfield uh, for getting me in and out on the weekend. It means a lot. Uh, I came back here, checked in with the driver's lineup, they set my PTA out for six o'clock this morning as there's nothing going on. Right. Sorry about that. I had somebody waving at me. Um, must be a fan. Um, well, I did talk to mechanic exclusively and extensively about the 24 Peterbilts that are coming in. He goes, uh, you know, I wish you could order a Cummings, but with Prime, no such luck. So the pack cars are finicky. We're having problems with the fuel injector. He recommended putting fuel injector cleaner. Uh, he said he's done some research on it because he's got a Cummings pickup fuel injection problems too. So he's using this stuff called Hot Shot, uh, which I'm gonna research a little bit more and start adding, it's one ounce per 10 gallons of fuel. Because the fuel coming out of, out of these truck stops are just nasty, dirty, and they tend to clog. So most of the problems that we're seeing with these injectors are people who exclusively are more than ordinary fuel that loves. Try to avoid loves like the plague. Pilot TA, so I'm gonna take his recommendation, even though I love you, I love, I love loves. But it doesn't mean I can't say that, it means you can't use the fuel. But that's what's going on, the fuel's dirty today, it's, it's through the filters, and starts playing havoc with your injector. Being that the injectors, my year is a 32,000 PSI injector, the new injectors are 44,000 PSI, which means more at the clock. So that's it, man. So uh, looking forward to eating, getting back to the hotel, taking a shower, and getting out of there early in the morning. And hopefully we have a load getting out of here. Certainly need it by Wednesday. All right, Big H is out. Peace out.